Hello and welcome to all of you in my channel. Friends, today we are going to explore how to make stack files from the different files of uh, different layers in Q in Diva GIS. So friends, as you know that file stacking or layer stacking is very much essential step while dealing with any kind of study in GIS environment. Suppose somebody wants to study climatic variables and uh, you may aware that this particular software of Diva GIS is very much essential to study climatic data of uh, any kind of region of the world. And suppose somebody wants to study rainfall distribution of uh, an area of interest and uh, he might have downloaded the monthly climatic data like this. You can see that this is the rainfall files that we have downloaded by using WorldClimb database. And uh, if somebody wants to make the stack file out of this monthly rainfall data, then this is the stack option where you can make this stack files. Here is the make stack option where you have to double click it and uh, you have to add this grids of uh, monthly rainfall data. So I'm going to add this grid files. I have kept these downloaded rainfall monthly rainfall database here you can see that rain one is the rainfall of the month of January and rain 12 GID file is the rainfall of the month of December here we have to select this all files by clicking the shift button and entering this 12 rainfall grid option you can select this all files here is the file number 2 rain 2 and you can see that this 12 months rainfall data is here then we have to give the output folder output name you can assign any kind of name i have given here one rain underscore stack grs stack file then you can check this these are the 12 month data of rainfall 1 2 3 12 and you have to just click here this apply button it has already created this you can plot Here is this file one rain stack GRS is the stack file of 12 month rainfall that uh, I'm going to select. And uh, this is the click on map option that you have to activate and click anywhere on the map that you will get this monthly rainfall and uh, this is the statistics you can get this horizontal bars or points you can have log file format you can study the regression among this 12 month rainfall so friends as this way this is the most applicable and uh, 
best option for study of any kind of climatic data or any kind of database so friends please like share and subscribe my channel thank you for watching my channel